Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Tanya Stevens. I'm with 50 is not old and we're here today to talk about the perfect lip. Before we get started, I want to make sure that you are following me. So be sure to ring the bell and follow. And if you find value in this, like, comment and share with others so they can also learn. I'll be sharing tips on hair, beauty and fashion. So I hope you will find something that you love. Let's get started. Okay, so I am going to be using three products. This is a Chanel lipstick, a white eyeliner, and just a thin little brush. So the way I get started is this Chanel, for one thing, has two ends. This part would be the lipstick part. This part up here will be the gloss. We'll use that later. But it is a tapered end, as you can see, and I usually just pull off a lot of the lipstick to begin with. Because this is a lip stain, it doesn't go away when you make mistakes. So I take off a lot, and I'm going to apply this, and I'm going to keep quiet and let you see. So basically I did a very thin coat giving me a lot, an outline. I did not use a lip liner. Instead I used the chiseled tip. Then I uh, fill in with the extra lip stain. Oops, mistake there. And that's what this little uh, white, it's creamy white eyeliner will do for me. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do the bottom end right here in this white. And I will do the Cupid's bow. And if there was any other, you know, here or here or here, I had make a mistake and I wanted to uh, make that go away, then I take my thin little brush. Very thin. Keep this separate from anything else because you don't want to use an eyeshadow brush and be getting black all over yourself. And I just Blend that in with the skin tone. What that does is that makes your lips pop and makes them look sharp and perfect. Finish with the gloss on the other end. And guess what? You've got the perfect lip. I hope you like this. Remember, comment, like, and share if you like it so others will find value also. All right, see you girls. 